Picture this. A woman, Mrs. Johnson, is rushed into the emergency department. She's 56, has a history of diabetes and hypertension, and now she's febrile, hypertensive and confused. Her symptoms suggest severe sepsis. The medical team springs into action, implementing a sepsis protocol, which includes a crucial decision. Starting a noradrenaline infusion at 0.1 microgram per kilogram per minute. How would you do this? First, calculate the initial dose. Given her estimated weight of 70 kilograms, the dose comes to 7 mcg per minute. Then prepare the noradrenaline. Dilute 4 milligrams, that's 4,000 micrograms, in 250 milliliters of normal saline. This creates a concentration of 16 micrograms per milliliter. Next, set the infusion pump. You want to deliver 7 micrograms per minute. This translates to approximately 0.44 milliliters per minute. Simply divide 7 micrograms per minute by 16 micrograms per milliliter. Begin the noradrenaline infusion at this rate. Adjusting as necessary to maintain a mean arterial pressure of 65 millimeters of mercury or higher. These steps provide a lifeline for patients like Mrs. Johnson. They ensure that, despite her hypertension, her organs receive adequate blood flow. In the high-stakes world of emergency medicine, knowing how to initiate a noradrenaline infusion can, quite literally, be a matter of life or death. For easy drug dose and infusion rate calculations, consider downloading the Dr. Med Made Easy app, available for both iPhone and Android.